Hey everyone, this is Rukshika Rajkumar from Arduino Projects by R and today I'm going to present you my secured car parking system using Arduino. Sorry I haven't posted in a while. The duration of this project was one week and uh, it was because of some faulty jumper cables. To prevent my project duration increasing because of faulty jumper cables, I'm going to make a faulty jumper cable tester and you can see that in one of my future uploads. This project uses an Arduino Uno, solderless breadboard half plus, external power supply for my solderless breadboard. I have used an external power supply for my solderless breadboard here because all these components draws out so much of power from my Arduino Uno. This external power supply can switch between 3.3 volts or 5 volts. I've connected this to my voltage regulator here. My voltage regulator uses my laptop's adapter which uses uh, 3.15 amps and 19 volts. This voltage regulator regulates that voltage at 8.6 volts. And when connected to this external power supply, this chain this converts 8.6 volts into 5 volts. A relay module, LCD display module with I2C interface, it's 16 by 2. MFRC 522 RFID reader, Tau Pro servo motor SG90, IR tracking sensor, some LEDs, RFID tags. 4 pin 4 digit 7 segment display module and of course some jumper wires. This model can be used for private car parking and now let me explain you how this works. This will be the this will be the authorized RFI tag and this will be the RFI tag with unauthorized access. When I place this card in this the RFID reader will read this RFID tag and if and since it's the authorized tag you'll see a message displayed in this LCD screen which says that the access will be granted. Once it shows that the access is granted the servo motor turns and the barricade is open. Uh, the relay module is switched on. And when it's switched on, the lights inside this uh, garage will light up. And as a prototype, I've used some LEDs and I've also connected my uh, a 120 ohm resistor to 5 volts to show you how this uh, model works. The lights will be switched on. When the car passes this IR tracking sensor, this 4 digit 7 segment display model will show stop and the servo motor will rotate and make the barrier closed. When you place the authorized uh, RFID tag in front of the RFID reader, this 4 digit 7 segment display will show you the countdown. Uh, I've used 15 seconds here and uh, while the card is kept in position, the card, you can see that Seven segment display module showing the countdown from 15 to 0. Once the countdown reaches 0, you will uh, see that it shows stop. And once it shows stop, the servo motor will rotate and the barricade will be closed. When the person comes out, he can take the card out of the position. When I place this unauthorized tag in front of the RFID reader, the LCD screen will show you uh, that the access is denied and this 4 digit 7 segment display model will show stop. To learn how I did this project, please visit my blog. The link can be found in the description below. Now let me show you how this works.
watching if you haven't subscribed please subscribe to my channel and follow my blog click on the bell icon to receive notifications about the latest updates don't forget to comment like and share